welcome back to my channel i hope you're all well in today's video we're going to be doing a miss pap autumn winter kind of unboxing but slash like try on haul i got a couple of their bits and bobs in the summer last year and i just feel like they're really good for like the staples they're very much kind of my style very much into like tailoring co-ord nice like thick jumpers and stuff like that and i feel like for the price you can always get a really really cool like funky piece it's not just a blazer like it's a really cool like chunky oversized shoulder pad blazer and i think that's one of the best things about autumn fashion you can kind of play around with like your jackets and your jumpers and you want pieces that you can wear and layer up and mix and match so that's what i've kind of aimed for in today's video and with today's shop if you would like to see what i got from miss pap for autumn winter 2022 then please keep watching so as usual i'm going to go through these in kind of like outfits and then i will obviously show you guys what they look like on so the first thing i'm going to show you is these gorgeous boots you guys remember from my autumn sheen haul from last year i actually got some white kind of welly boots and i wore them so much that i literally broke the sole so this year i was like i'm definitely getting some new ones and i feel like black is just obviously such a staple in your wardrobe and because i'm going away in a few weeks obviously i want to be able to take a pair of winter boots with me but i'm trying to obviously pack as little as possible so something like this is very practical because it will go with hopefully a lot of my outfits i'm really excited about these they feel like really really good quality inside they are super padded and they're super like thick it doesn't feel like a really flimsy boot if that makes sense so it's got like a zip detail at the front and then the soles are nice and chunky it's also got these little pulls at the top which i think is always great when you're trying to get a boot on but then outfit number one we're going to start off with this gorgeous cute little bodysuit so it's this nude ribbed material it's kind of got like a high neck obviously you guys will see when it's on and it's just obviously sleeveless i think this is going to be such a staple in my wardrobe like all year round obviously you can layer it up or just wear it on its own the pair of jeans or a pair of shorts in the spring or the summer what i liked about this as well is that the bottom is actually quite long because there's nothing worse than a bodysuit that is really tight and it hits on there so i'm always here for like a nice high v and lots of room lots of wiggle room so to layer on top of the bodysuit i got this really really gorgeous knitted co-ord if you've watched any of my try on videos there's probably a co-ord in there i love them i love the fact that it kind of makes the decision for me when it comes to like deciding what to wear so it's this gorgeous knitted set it comes with these really cool like knitted shorts it's this gorgeous like creamy color the waist as well is elasticated and then to pair with the shorts this gorgeous little turtleneck jumper and it's just so so cute this is obviously just such an easy option in the autumn to like layer it up with everything things like this are just perfect for work because it still feels like quite fashionable and you've kind of like thought about what you want to wear but it's really easy and simple to do so this would look gorgeous with a pair of trousers like suit trousers and then like a chunky boot underneath the one thing i would say with this set is i was a little bit skeptical because of the price that it would just be quite like a cheap quality knit sometimes when you get like knit wear online and it's quite cheap it tends to feel a little bit see-through when i got this out of the packet i was genuinely shocked at like how soft it was and how good quality it feels i don't know if i'm going to wear it all together but i also got this gorgeous blazer and my kind of thought was to go with the bodysuit the shorts and then the blazer and then kind of had the jumper wrapped over it's all that idea of layering up and then still look really cool if you get too hot you can take your jumper off things like that i feel like this is again a piece that i can wear all year round like in the summer a cream blazer is obviously gorgeous it's really nice and like thick material it's got these gorgeous kind of shoulder pads the style itself is oversized so obviously it does fit a little bit bigger and then there's a pocket on both sides which are actual pockets as well there's no faux pockets around here <laughs> the only thing i would say about this is that it came quite creased and i understand that it's come in a packet i've ordered it online and it's been delivered but it is like white creased compared to everything else i'm just hoping it doesn't say super creased because it looks a bit wild at the minute so for outfit number two again we're going to keep the black boots on this outfit is a lot more simplified we've only got one item so we've got this gorgeous kind of cable knit jumper dress it feels amazing <laughs> this one's obviously a really high turtleneck that you can roll down i just love that when it's like a really chunky collar so the arms are like gathered at the sleeve and then what is so cool about this dress is that it's got this kind of like deconstructed hem and i just think it'll look really cool on it just feels again it's like the little details that make it feel a little bit more high fashion than you would get 
normally from like your other brand you think of a jumper dress it's quite plain this helps to kind of like bring it up a notch and make it still feel really really cool so i'm really excited about this i would probably wear something under this just a really basic black play suit or a little dress underneath give you another layer but i think you'd be super warm it already feels warm just like holding it in my arms so i can't wait to put this on it's gonna be so cozy outfit number three this is like me reaching out of my comfort zone a little bit so i got these trousers right and I've only started kind of venturing out into brown, I suppose, in the past like couple of years. I would have never normally worn anything brown, but it's obviously become quite cool to be, wear quite neutrals and like be monochromatic. So I'm going for a monochromatic brown look. They are like a ruched wide leg pan and then they've got this kind of like zip detail down the front. Very kind of like cowgirl F, but I'm always here for that. And then the back again has these pockets in them and again they're full pockets. Inside it's got this really nice like kind of suede-esque trim. I feel like you can't really see the ruching as much with them in my hand. I'm hoping obviously once I've got them on you can see it's going to start to kind of come together and just be like a really cool like more sculptural pan. I am really excited about them but I'm just hoping they look as good on as they did online. To go with the trousers I've got this like really cute distressed brown jumper so it's got like this really nice like raw edge on the front the sleeves again i've got like this little like bit of like distress and then on the neck as well it's kind of like hobo chic but we're here for it too i just kind of love a croc jumper this is definitely something i can layer over other things like shirts or midi dresses just by holding it it feels really snugly it's nice and heavy you know you've got a good knit jumper when you can feel the weight of it It'd be interesting to see how this wears over time obviously with the distress detail it's whether that will like frame more i'm hoping that it will like add to the look and feel of it all and it'll just feel even more kind of grungy and yeezy-esque we're going down that route of like homeless chic so last but not least we've got another cohort this is again probably quite like a simple outfit i don't know if this would class as like loungewear for some people but i would wear this out of the house the top is this kind of really like boxy oversized kind of like tank this is a little bit like thinner material wise but i think this could be really cool like layered up again you could wear this with the blazer over it you could probably put like a little jump underneath this and wear it over obviously you can mix and match it so then the trousers again are the same material they're just like this really long wide leg trouser having like a nice easy like wide leg black trouser is so useful for work and them being that little bit more of like a cozy knit feel it just feels really nice to put it on in the morning like getting up and going to work and you can just put something cozy but then still look really cool and like professional obviously the bottom of the leg is also like split on the end which i think is a really nice detail my idea was to wear these over the boot and just have like an all black moment that feels very put together but it's really really easy autumn so that is all the outfits complete and tried on i hope you guys have enjoyed today's video there's definitely some of like my new autumn favorites i'm just like so excited to wear all of these pieces out i think i can literally see all the outfits coming together in my head and like how i'm going to style them all i don't think anything's going to be something that i wear once and never wear again they're all kind of like monochromatic colors and neutrals and things that can be worn with lots of different things so that is everything from me don't forget to like and subscribe if you enjoyed today's video and comment below and let me know your favorite looks thank you guys so much for watching i will see you very shortly in my next video